Well, I did not vlog every day, did I? I mean, the first day post-op, I could barely even type. By the third day, I was going out and doing stuff, but apparently, I still wasn't up for making a video. So here's the post-op video that you've all been waiting for. In fact, a couple of you have been hounding me for it, so here it is. As you can see when I was sitting, these are my bandages and my little blood grenades. Um, this part is what most people have, is just for the, the chest surgery. Um, and this part is the man sculpture compression garment that they gave me that I also can't take off. Um, it makes me look like I'm pregnant a little bit, but that's just like the bandage like folding over on itself. So it really hurts. It's like a million times tighter than a regular binder and I have to sleep in it every night and I can never take it off or shower. So it's basically the most awful thing ever. Worth it, but awful. Tomorrow at 10 a.m., it's the big reveal. I'll be taking all of this off. I haven't been able to see anything yet. I don't know what my nipples look like, but they keep tingling, and it's really weird. I can, like, feel them. It's like a baby kicking, but it's just my nipples. I'm touching them. See, I don't even know where they are, because they used to be. I don't even know where they used to be, but now they're somewhere different, so. So, as you can see, I'm already practicing the whole never wearing a shirt thing. I'd say I'm getting pretty good at it. But uh, the one thing that I forgot, or I didn't even think of, is to bring, like, button-up shirts here because I can't, like, put shirts over my head. And I completely forgot about that, so I had to go to Walmart and uh, buy a couple before surgery, which I'm just, you know, not wearing right now because why would I be wearing shirts? I have washed my hair a couple times. It's really hard to wash the back, so I feel like the back of my hair is still dirty, and, but the front of my hair is all nice and clean and smells like coconuts because that's what the Holiday Inn has given me. So I'm alive. I didn't die or drop off the face of the planet. I uh, know some people have been asking me for the shopping list that they gave me and I'll be making more videos. That'll be, that'll be in it and I'll send that out to people who want it and I'll be talking more about man sculpture and all of that good stuff. It's about to get really educational up in here. This video is just to basically say that I'm alive and show you how I'm moving, what, like, uh, four days post-op? The surgery was June 1st, so that was, like, it's the 5th now, so four days ago, basically. This is the period where my dad went back home to Maryland, and my cousin's coming, but he won't be here until, like, 11 at night, so I'm stuck here by myself for, like, eight hours. So I'll just throw myself a little hotel party here by myself. Um, all right, so this is me, four days post-op, yeah. You will see my nipples tomorrow. Bye.